Hello everybody. How are you? How are you feeling? What the weather you have? Huh? Look at this. <laughs> Yo. Eh? Cool, right? Okay, let's go. So today I will show you how to check to repair and to do calibration learning in Toyota MMT without nothing. If you don't have text stream, any scanner, just just with this super device. It's a wire. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's go. So, I have this Toyota. It's the Verso with problem. So, I will do the diagnostic. We'll resolve the problem. And we'll do calibration. Okay, let's go. What I need to do first? First, I need to connect this super device to the OBD connector. I need this, 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 this. Oh, look, I need the one, two, three, four from this side. And one, one, two, three, four from other side. Yes, yes. Now let's turn on the switch and we will understand, we will check what is the trouble code. Ah, the key. Okay. Okay, one, no, one, two, one, one, two, one, it's okay, so we have only one trouble code and it's number 21, let's check what does this mean. Look at this, and it's, you see, malfunction in the clutch drive circuit. I will tell you, this is the short circuit on the, or oh, short circuit or open circuit on the electrical motor of clutch actuator. This is the number, and this is still... One twenty one. We have if if we will have two code, it will twenty one for example and thirty five. Thirty five clutch position controller. Roll. So it will twenty one pause thirty five pause twenty one pause thirty five pause and circle. <laughs> okay. So, what we need to do? We need to repair this clutch actuator, okay? This one. I also has repaired and installed it, okay? And what I need to do now, I need to do calibration. How we can do it? We also can do it with this super device with wire. So I will now remove it. Yes, it's installed. So what we need to do? Now I will show you instruction. If you need this file, I will send you. If you don't understand, read again, again, 
as, as we you will understand it okay now i will show you how to do it we will do calibration only for, for clutch i will not do calibration for tcm or else or gearbox i change the clutch actuator so i will do calibration only for clutch okay So, I, I need to do initi initialization, initialization of clutch. I need to do this one. So, please carefully read what need to do. And follow all these steps. Okay, let's, let's go. I need, first of all, I need to, okay, neutral, reconnect jumper, okay, okay. Pump the brake pedal at least seven times within three seconds. Okay, so let's do it. I'm not pushing the brakes. I'm turn on the switch and push brakes seven times. Pick, pick. Okay. Now I'm release the brake and push it again. Now I'm going to plus minus plus minus neutral release the brake and push it again three sounds again it will three sounds now i need to fast to fast push brake three times pick pick it's mean okay. Now I'm release the brake, turn off the switch. And remove the super scanner. Yes. It's removed, removed. Now Waiting for about 10, 15 seconds, okay? And now I'm turn on the switch without brakes and, and looking on the dashboard. And I need, uh, I will hear the sound. The clutch actuator must jig, jig, do this one. Yes, I heard it. It make jig, jig. Okay, now I can start the car. The neutral will flash in, blinking, blinking, and stop. It means that's all okay. Okay, let's let's go. So I'm push the brake and start the car. Yes, that's all. Now. The car is okay. Look at this. That's all my video. As you can see, you can check it. You can calibrate it without any help by yourself with my help. And before do any calibration, please, because a lot, a lot of people call me, I don't have neutral, the neutral is disappear. Don't do calibration before you has resolved the problem. The calibration, it's not resolving the problem. You must do calibration only when you sure that the car fully good good no problem okay 
So thank you for watching. Thank you for good words in my in the comments. Yeah. <laughs> what I want to say. Call me, message me. I have all parts. I sell parts for these cars with warranty, full support. So thank you again and good luck.